across the bridge, they had to pass the police station before them reach the ATM. So they realized that there was a police station, so they just turn around and head back on the highway. When we go back on the highway, the car, a girl, was on the side of the road stopping the car. Yeah man, the car up. Yeah man. The man them realized, the driver realized, and he pulled off of the road and stopped. Wind down the front glass and said, Ochi. Ochi my girl. Uh, jump in now. Came in the car, the, the guy had the gun in my side now. So the car drove off like normal again. This time the one up front turned around and pointed the gun on her and tell her say she forgive all that she have. So they took that from her and asked her where she had go, um, if she have any kids yet, if she have no man, when last she do not. You have man? When last are six? What kind of question that you ask me? Upon reaching a section of the roadway, the man up front start assault her. Right? Yeah. And the driver turned around and at one point he take him hand and push between our legs. When these sexual predators do these things, it is inevitable to avoid asking these questions. Do they have a mother, aunts, sisters, any relatives that are female? And the worst part of it is that sometimes these predators have daughters and they would be the first one to kill someone if they violate their kids in any way. Worse in regards to what they're doing to others.